Hi, baby. Good morning. <laughs> Mom, Hi, egg baby. Want to make me some coffee? Maybe some eggs and toast? Yeah? No? Maybe? Maybe? How does that sound? Eggs and toast? Eggs and toast. Eel pen. <laughs> Surf swim. This one's apparently super freaking easy. I don't expect so, considering last time. You wouldn't expect so? I would expect so, considering last time. Why? I last time was easy. Why would you not expect it to be like that? I'm saying I would expect it to be easy. Oh my god. That's what you said. <laughs> there he is, waiting for you. <laughs> Why is he laughing? He has no right to laugh. <laughs> man. Foolish man. Man Drake. What is a man? <laughs> we already did that in Monsters, Inc. I just- I love that fucking scene so much. I love Richter, I love- Oh, wait, what? Okay, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. okay. The phone's going off. Is it? No, oh, it's fucking- it's a nothing number. No, don't answer it. Why? I, I don't want them to think that this is an active number. But I kind of want to answer it. Okay, answer it. <laughs> Hello? Fifty? Don't fucking press one. Do not press one. <laughs> Just hang up. <laughs> it's never a real person. <laughs> I get um sometimes you at get the, some weird ones. Yeah, no, at the oh yeah, I remember when I just got that woman speaking Chinese and then like an anthem played over yeah, it. Yeah, that was so weird. But it, I um when I was at the liquor store, I would always get phone calls. It's like, do not hang up the phone. <laughs> Your Google store is not oh. uh, linked, and it's like, okay, fuck you. Okay, cool. And do you guys realize that Did when you say don't hang up the phone, I'm gonna hang up the phone? I have, a, I have a question for everyone. If if I don't know if you got this email either, it was a Google settlement claim. What? It was a Google. I got this email and I was so confused and I immediately thought it was a scam. It was like Google uh, is settling for for a claim, so you can't sue them. Oh, uh, it's it, like it listed a bunch of numbers and then I kept scrolling down to see how much I would get. It said if you fill this out, you'll get twelve dollars. And I was immediately like, all right, so this probably isn't a scam, because who the fuck would offer $12? That's not enticing at all. <laughs> that's, that's a chore to get $12. <laughs> and then it Take said, the trash, get $12. And then it said, if you don't accept this claim, then you can't sue. It's like, that's not how a settlement works. What? It's not a settlement works you, at all. What do you mean? I choose if I want to take the claim or not. I can still fucking sue you. Don't fucking pull that shit with me. Alright, you that could sue us for a million dollars, or... Twelve dollars. Twelve dollars, settlement. And then you can't sue at all, if you deny it. I don't, if anyone else got that email, I'm, I'm curious, but... Did you settle? No, it, it made you do a bunch of shit to get it. Like, you had to for go to this dollars. website, fill out information, put your Google information. I'm like, no, I'm not... If this was a scam, am I really gonna get scammed for twelve fucking dollars? Is that really my low point in life? There's a lot- uh, another weird thing that people do- well, not even people, I- I, f I don't feel like guys do this as much, but- uh, 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 Putting people on, in boxes, are you? No, it, it just doesn't make sense for guys to do this. At least I can't see a guy doing this. And, um, on, on Tinder, a lot of girls put, like, their cash app in their bio. Does that work? <laughs> Like, what, what fucking simp is paying for women that I'm they haven't sure even met? I'm sure it's a lot more common than you think. It, they would not put it there if that... If it didn't if happen If that didn't work at all. I know you... Some girls in college, they, they get money on Craigslist for posting feet pics. Feet, feet pics. pics. <laughs> Slip of the tongue. Feet pics. Po buddy's nerfing, right? Feet pics! <laughs> kids pics! Everybody likes kids pics! Wow! I need my peat fix for the day. <laughs> Remember coming to school early and uh, You're really bad at that. Yeah. I remember coming to school early at unnamed elementary school and and because I was on safety patrol. Yeah, and I would be in the, the library. Doing either your AP work or or what is it, AR? I hardly did. Oh, AR, that's what it's called. Blue I sticker. I hardly ever did augmented reality. If that book doesn't have a, a, a blue sticker, I ain't wasting my time. I, I ain't fucking reading that shit. 
Why no, would I, I? I hardly ever did those. I think Series of Unfortunate Events is my only one that I did. I did it with bird books. <laughs> like, I would I would rent books that involve birds. I think I would do the same. No, I mean, not birds, but I would always be like, oh, this one is about turtles, and then I'm read about turtles. And then if I wanted AR points, I would pick random tests, and then just guess on them, and then maybe get points. Because, what, like, okay, I, I didn't get points, I'll just try another test. God. Oh my god. Oh! Jump! Jesus Christ! I'd like to see you jump on a tightrope. Oh, right, funny. Look, there's a hole. Is that where you're heading? Yeah. Let's see if I land. Uh, oh! No, that's not where I want to be. Why not? You can just side flip it on. Oh, I could have yeah. done this earlier then. <laughs> Dummy. Dummy thief. I don't think we have many of these left. The floodless levels. No, we don't. You're correct. Spinny, spinny. We've been playing for a while. Yeah, I think this is two hours now. Yeah, I, I think it's close to that, yeah. Look at you, you're in a box. Don't put me in a box. No I'm one not... puts baby in a corner. <laughs> I'm not a statistic. One of these is a one-up. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. I like a Mario too big. What am I gonna have to eat? I don't know. We don't this really is probably gonna be our only recording for today because I still have eat haven't eaten. I haven't eaten either. Shout. Wow. Is it this one? I'm not gonna go back for that other one. Because we got a lot of uh, lives from that one Yoshi one. Yoshi? Yoshi? Yoshi. Whoa! Okay, Nitro. That's what they should have called Scalar. That would have been a cool name. Don't get too close to that Nitro. Don't get too close to Powder Keg. <laughs> I wonder how many people actually go to Silver Dollar City, Branson. I don't know, actually. I feel like Branson's like the poor man's... Oh wait, I don't have a Flood. <laughs> Poor man's close attraction. Yeah, I feel like Branson's the poor man's, like, Los Angeles. I mean, I'm not wrong. The, the southern version of Los Angeles. Yeah, basically. I feel like you'll see a lot of the same stuff. We used to be friends with the Silver Dollar Boys, you remember? Yeah, we, we talked to them. They know us, actually. They subscribe. That'd be fucking... Oh. Silver Dollar Boys, let's fucking meet up. You don't remember us, but let's meet up. Watch it be like, one of the Silver Dollar Boys died recently. <laughs> That'd actually be kind of sad. They were pretty old. They're probably retired, like, fishing somewhere. All three of them on a single boat. They all hated each other. <laughs> when we went back, they were different. Were they? Yeah. They I weren't the same that. Silver Dollar Boys. You aren't the same Silver Dollar Boys that I know. Sing Green Anchors! <laughs> Donald Trump singing Green Acres. Green, Green Acres is the place to be. That does not. A <laughs> <laughs> fucking Alec Baldwin's impression. Green Acres is the place to he's be. He's just being himself. Like he does in every movie he's in. I think the thing I hate most about Trump's uh, uh, administration is the fact that Alec Baldwin plays him on SNL. That's the worst part. I think, I, honestly, worst part. That's the worst part. I fucking hate that guy. Nothing but hate. <laughs> there he goes. Oh man, that's gonna be tricky. You're hungry. Fudgy hungry now. <laughs> fudgy hungry now. Get fudgy food. <laughs> Put up a clip of Fudgy being hungry. Fudgy's fudgy hungry, hungry now. Give him food, Fortniteers. Yeah, Fudgy goes. I like Fortnite. Fudgy want Fortnite now. Fudgy want W. We only get those W's. Bobby, you gotta learn to get a W yourself. Bobby, let me hand you this L. <laughs> Bobby, just take the L, boy. Just take the L. Bobby, I'm making a diss track. What rhymes with asshole? Do you think Bobby wants Hank to be sexually active? No. <laughs> I, could, I couldn't see Bobby being like, Dad, go slay that pussy! Why don't you do what I did when I was playing and, like, mash the dive? Maybe I'll, like, slide up. 
Oh, there that works go. too. Alright, didn't want to do that. That was weird. Normally you have to spin to do it. Tyler has issues doing side flips all of a sudden. Oh, this is our jump, Tyler. That's not what you have to do. We have to get on this. You have to do a corner. Oh, you can try that, but... Oh! Look at that. This one, I don't think I can get away with that. I think you have to do the corner. Oh. Yeah. Wait. Oh, shit. Wait, hold on. This is what you've been trying to, to do your whole life. <laughs> I look up there and I get teleported in Okubei. <laughs> Wait, maybe I can... No. No way. No, you can't do it. You're only gonna cause yourself pain in the third. What?! What's up, bitch? Impossible! What's up, bitch? Is that oh skip? God. He still has so much left. These aren't too bad. At these, though. Again, this is my Animal Crossing house. Ooh, this one's faster though, Tyler. Nope. Oh god. Fuck! Oh! Oh! Get across! <laughs> that, that that was like those fucking rides at Universal, that 4D rides. It's like, I know what I'm doing, and then meanwhile shit's happening in the background. Yeah. What's your favorite 4D ride you've ever been on? Ooh, Justice League. Justice League? That's pretty good. I like that ride a lot. I remember the uh, Shrek one. That ride sucks. It is awful. That ride fucking blue. Blue chunks. We had that on. Do you remember that? I do remember that. We had that. We got 3D glasses. With I remember. It. I remember going into that ride and being like, "Wait a minute." Yeah, I, I remember too. I remember going there and being like, "Did I really just wait in line to experience what I experienced at home as a kid multiple times because I replayed?" That I mean, it was video? somewhat nostalgic, but like it was nostalgic. But then it was like, "Wow, we really because the line was long. It was not a short line. It was not my number one." I don't even know how I survived that last little stretch. Wait, you did it. It's talking about the Shrek ride at Universal. It's the Shrek ride. I remember that uh, SpongeBob SquarePants one. Oh yeah, that wasn't that was at Mall of America. I think, I think so. I think that's Mall of that's America. That's owned by Viacom. Yeah, the all of the mall, the fucking the Mall of America, the American pillar of malls, is owned by a company. It's an amusement park, Tyler. No, <laughs> it's not an amusement park. Wrong. Put up, put up a picture of Mike being wrong. Can't find one. 